Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, you are going to learn how to set up Visual Studio Code with Java and Quarkus extension. Let's start and follow my steps. Open Visual Studio Code. On the left side of the screen, click on the icon Extensions and type Quarkus inside the search box. Click on the first result. Make sure to select the Quarkus extension provided by Red Hat. Click on the button Install and then Wait. Good. Now in the search box type Java. Click on the first result, Extension Pack for Java, provided by Microsoft. You have also the possibility to install the extension language support for Java, provided by Red Hat. But if you take a closer look at the extension pack, it is already included. So let's install it. After that, you have to configure the Java runtime. Click on the Get Your Runtime Ready. In this panel, you have the possibility to select the version of the JDK that you want to use. If you have to install it, select the Java version and then click on Install. Follow all the steps. After that, inside the tab Java Tooling Runtime, you can see the path of your Java installation. Of course, you can do a quick look at all the extensions available in Visual Studio Code. Let's use the Quarkus extension provided by Red Hat to create a new Quarkus project. Inside the command bar, type Quarkus generate project, select Maven, and then put the group and artifact ID. Then put the package name and resource. And in the end, you can select all Quarkus dependencies that you want to use. Good. Now you have your Quarkus project generated inside Visual Studio Code. On the left side of the screen, there is the Java project and Maven section. Inside the Maven section, you can see the Maven lifecycle option and also plugins. If you click on plugins, you will see the famous Quarkus dev. Let's click on the play button to run the project in development mode. Good, the server is up and running. In this video, you have learned how to configure Visual Studio Code with Java and Quarkus extension. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to my channel to be always updated about new videos that I will upload. And see you in the next one. Bye.